We're here with Sky Blue FC head coach Jim Gabera and assistant coach Rick Staten. Uh, just wrapped up the uh, 2011 WPS draft. Uh, uh, Jim, what do you think so far about the uh, two additions you made today? Uh, we're really looking forward to having them in camp, and uh, we think they'll earn roster spots. And uh, you know, we got what we needed in versatile players and uh, some speed in the back. Without that. And now, when you have two picks like that, uh, you know, with the first one coming, uh, you know, 16th overall. You know th that waiting process that kind of happens uh, leading up to that. Is that anything that causes you to, you know, kind of to pass the time almost until you to know exactly what you're dealing with? Uh, it's 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 entertaining to kind of kind of guess what other teams are going to pick and what direction they're going to go. But I don't think it's a stressful thing. And uh, what ends up happening is you end up having a few more players to pick from because everybody has a little different uh, need and also a different evaluation of players. So uh, it went by all right. You know, it seemed like a long time, but uh, it's just nice to be back with. Uh, all the teams and all the league officials and uh, all being one room is nice, especially what we've been through the last few months. And uh, Rick, what's your take? You know, you've actually seen, uh, you know, the, this pair play in the past. Um, you know, what was some of the things you saw that, as far as their qualities that impressed you? Well, with uh, Alyssa, she is a great distributor of the ball. Um, she's a good presence. She sees the field very well. Um, she looks like she has a very good soccer knowledge. And, uh, she'll be a tremendous asset right from the start. Everything with her personality and her uh, traits. Uh, and then with Lauren Alkek, uh, she played the outside back position, and she was just tough as nails. I mean, she goes into every tackle hard. She's a good physical presence. She's very speedy, um, has a big throw in, can also distribute uh, long balls out of the back, which uh, you know makes us for dangerous and counter attacks and stuff like that. And now, Jim, with the uh, you know the roster pretty much compiled at this point, and uh, you know coming up with camp, uh, you know a little over six weeks away. Uh, what's uh, the process uh, leading up to that now to get make sure the team's prepared to uh, kick off training? Well, our schedule is we'll have tryouts the 6th and 7th in Jersey, and then uh, report dates the 7th for players, the 8th we'll have physicals and meetings, and then we start training the 9th uh, through the 11th, and then the 12th we go to Turkey for the tournament in Italia, and uh, return on the 21st, and we have a couple of uh, exhibition games against college teams uh, leading up to our home opener on April 10th. And, uh, you know, as the season gets close like this and the excitement, uh, you know, starts to build, um, you know, something obviously you've done before in the past, but I'm sure it never gets old. Um, but, you know, as the season gets, uh, you know, closer like this, has, has the excitement started to build within you? Yeah, it's really exciting to get all the players in. I'm really looking forward to seeing them all together on the field. And, uh, you know, it never gets old. So it's, it's a great thing. And now, Rick, do you also have the excitement starting to build in yourself? Oh, absolutely. Uh, the season actually begun months ago, but it's right around the corner when the players report, and uh, we're truly excited and looking forward to it. All right, well, I'd like to thank both you coaches for uh, sharing a few minutes with us, giving us a little bit of insight. And, uh, you know, two big picks added to the team today. Uh, camp right around the corner, the season right around the corner. Fans are encouraged to uh, call the team at 888-SBFC-TIX to pick up their tickets. And just one more time, just want to thank you both for stepping in. Thank, thank you, John. See you.